concerned from the first day. But the more debate that it has stirred, the better I feel about it. I feel that it, is, it has caused people to come to, to the defense of the United Nations and of the Russians that I never heard before. Now, that's an interesting point, Chris. Are you saying that even if, if America is right-wing propaganda, that, that, that that's all right because it will stir the kind of left-wing opposition that you would like to have stirred? Not only left-wing, but, but uh, people that just maybe never thought about it before. I would hope that Americans would re-examine their attitudes toward Russia, but also they'd uh, re-examine their attitudes toward the, the principles uh, on which uh, the country is supposed to be founded. These views that you've been talking about, these, these political views, are they, you've got a new album which mm -hmm. is coming out very soon. Are these expressed musically as well as in this interview? Uh, some of them, yes. It's uh, one of them. I remember was a thing called Anthem 84, where I would like to continue to be a creative artist. I always wanted to write novels. And the novel won't be about some Hollywood jet setters who are concerned about the next deal, I get a feeling. Well, I, it'll probably be what I know about, and, uh, and that would probably not be about making the next deal. I don't make many deals. <laughs>